Hello and good morning. Welcome to your daily tarot read on the 14th of March, Thursday, the 14th of March 2024, with Hem from Self Love Self Care System. I have our daily, well, I'm doing our daily read today from the top back tarot deck. And they're very large, and <laughs> so I don't shuffle them. But I literally get three cards. I get one for the energy of the day. I get one for a problem, if there is one. And sometimes there isn't a problem. And one card. I always go where I'm drawn for the solution. The angels kind of call to me and say to me, this is the card you need. And then I take that card. And I give you that one. Sometimes I get an extra card if the reading doesn't make sense. But it's not so often that sometimes I do it. So are you ready? Are you ready to hear? what your readings are for Thursday the 14th of March 2024. Let's have a look. Oh, they are having a little giggle with you today. If you did not watch the reading of yesterday, you do need to check it out. You really, really, really do. It's not even funny. It's not even funny. <laughs> well, it is funny, actually. I'm laughing because it's it's funny. And when you if you go back and watch it, you will laugh with me because they love to repeat themselves. They love to repeat themselves. They're like a broken record, bless them. But I love them. We love them, don't we? Okay, so the energy of the day is the Nine of Pentacles. Now, for those of you that have been listening to these and working through them, you will know you're coming to the combination of something that is about how you understand abundance for yourself. This isn't about necessarily bringing abundance into your life. This is about how you understand abundance. What does it mean to you? What is abundance for you? How do you want your family life to be? How do you want your life to be? What do you want it to be? The energy of today is right. Okay, there's, there's a few things I want me to say about the energy of today, okay? So I'm just going to say them exactly as I sang them. Thing one is you're going to feel good. You're going to feel quite materially supported. You're going to feel quite good about things. You may even be able to help someone out today or buy lunch for a friend. There's a little bit of that going on. You're feeling better than usual in your scope for monetary things, okay? Yeah? And the other thing is that they're saying to me that you know you're coming to the culmination of understanding something that's been a little bit of a thing for you. Yeah, it's been a little bit of a thing for you with regard to how... Right, okay, this is how they're saying it to me. Many of you have not really dealt with that financial stuff effectively. And this day, today, Thursday, and Thursday weirdly is the money day. It's linked to that kind of thing, financial, judgment, law, legal, that kind of thing. So they're saying something's going to come up that will assist you with this. Right, okay, this is how they're showing it to me. You may not necessarily know it today, but it will, it will kick off in your mind today. So you're going to get an answer to something that's going to make something a little bit more clear for you. So that's that's literally what they're telling me. They're telling me to tell you things are going to be much better. Now, the other thing is that they're saying to me as well with the end of this, because you're, remember you're coming into a combination of this, and it's linked to family, home, abundance. It's linked to monetary, financial as well. But it's also linked to relationship because they're asking me to point out your sacral chakra. And they're saying, make sure that these things are healed and cleaned. Because when you go past this space, if they're not, you're going to go back around again. Okay? All right? All right. And let's see if there's a problem. Knight of Wands. I don't actually see a major problem in this. So this is the card you've got. Are we seeing a problem in this, angels? Well, actually, yeah, they're saying there is a little bit of one, but I, I, okay, no, I'm going to say what they're saying because they're asking me to say it first. Okay, so what they're telling me is there's stuff that you need to negotiate and sort out and clean up. And rather than going into the energy of the king, you're, you're stopping in the energy of the knight, which is, it's not enough. I'm really sorry about that. I don't know what that is. It sounds like someone's drilling outside my front door, which is a bit weird. Hang on, bear with me a moment. I'm just going to pause this. So I'm not sure. No, it seems to have stopped, so that's fine. So yeah, so um, you you haven't kind of gone into the king energy. You're sort of in the night energy only. And that energy is... It's okay. You know, let, let's look at it this way. So you've got this... Sorry, I am going to pause this moment. Sorry about that. Two people were using a saw on their trainers. Oh, sneakers, you probably guys call them in the States. I have no idea, and I can't explain it to you, because it's the weirdest thing I've ever seen. So, where was I? I was talking about you need to kind of go into the king energy because you're finishing this off. But it's okay, because you're moving forwards, and you're moving forwards into whatever the solution is, okay? And I'll explain it to you. Um, 
I did kind of get a glimpse of the solution, so I kind of got an idea now of what this is. But you do need to negotiate your way through this and step through this. The other thing is, is to connect into your heart. The angels are saying to me, connect into your heart, to tell you guys to step into your heart, and go where you're really wanting to go, as opposed to where... It's really interesting, because as I look at this, for some of you, you're still feeling like you need to go where you've been told to go, as opposed to where you want to go, all right? So the solution, even though I don't think that this is a major problem, okay, is the Three of Pentacles. Now, I do need to get another card for this. It's because I said it, didn't I? Um, Angels, can you just give me another card? So I'm just reaching out to the cards and taking them. Oh, makes sense. So we've got the Strength cards. So you need to be strong. And I get it, right? Remember I said you're not quite in the King energy. You're not quite up in the higher energy. By being strong, you can move up into that higher energy. You need to just push, right, I know what this is. I know what's coming up here for you guys, right? What I've been noticing as we've been going through the readings over the weeks, months, whatever it's been now, right? Many of us are dipping into um, a lower energy, then coming up into higher energy. They're dipping into a lower energy, then coming up again. This isn't going to work anymore. You need to start thinking strength and power and moving forward and being stronger so you can have the life that you deserve. You can't live in a consciousness that isn't fully absorbent of who you really are, fully about the authenticity of who you are. You see, what I'm seeing here is that you, it's almost like you, you feel strong enough sometimes and other times you don't feel strong enough. And I get that, don't get me wrong, I do get that because I've been there and I know it, I know what it is, I'm the same. However, we have to step right up in order to make those inroads in our lives and that's what they're saying to me to say to you, okay? So they're saying, you can do this, you are capable of doing this, all right, my lovelies? So there you go. That is your reading for Thursday, the 14th of March, 2024. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments. I would love to answer and help you with anything you've got. If you'd like a reading with me, please do check out www.selfloveselfcaresystem.com and you can have a reading with me. And I'm about to bring out new soul readings, which are audio or written readings of 30 minutes. That will give you answers to something and I connect into the angels for you, my angels and your angels, and get answers for you as you move forward. And they are going to be much better. You don't have to be there with me. When you book one of those, it does ask you to book a time, but it's fine. That time is just so that I actually do it for you. And then within a week, you'll get the reading from when it's done for you. So there you go, my lovelies. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet and you do feel cool to, please subscribe for me. Give me a thumbs up and come back tomorrow to check out the reading for the 15th of March. Send you all so much love. Have a lovely, lovely Thursday. Namaste, everyone. Kisses and love. And I'll speak to you tomorrow. Bye.